bike. Um, I just like our, I like our team. I like the effort. I like the improvement fundamentally. Uh, you know, uh, uh, it was um, interesting. We had we had we had only three penalties with the ones. We had three penalties on offense and zero pen defense. And I have a penalty the whole practice, which is pretty phenomenal. Uh, and then offense had uh, one offense had three penalties. Um, a couple of those are were uh, all of them can be corrected, but a couple of them were you know called back big plays, uh, missed opportunities, missed opportunities. Didn't do much game planning for the deal, you know, but uh, uh, I, I like I like how our guys competed. I, I like we've got talent, uh, and I, I think that we came out of Camp T, man, really close, as close as any team that I've had. Um, you know, I asked our coaches today about, I said, tell me what that experience was like for you. And just about every one of our coaches that, that, that are new here, and even the ones that have been here said that was the best you know week in their coaching career as far as being a part of something special so i think think camp t's we got to build upon that and and i think the this team has a chemistry and a and a closeness that's really positive obviously got a lot of things to work on but uh, uh i wanted to see you know i was very encouraged by the improvement we've made uh, defensively still attacking we've made some modifications in how we're doing that and Thought we did some. I thought we did a good job vertically cutting off receivers, uh, but uh, and then we missed some opportunities. You got to hit those opportunities. Um, we obviously have been working different people at center, so we had about five bad snaps. Uh, so when you, you and we didn't have that many plays, so you have about 50 plays and you have 13 negatives, it, it becomes a, a challenge for you. So, uh, but no, I, but I did. I loved how our guys competed all week. I loved the attitude. I and you know I was even like. You know, the way the field was looking that morning, I was really concerned about somebody getting hurt. And it was really, really, really muddy and uh, dried up nicely as the day went on. But uh, uh, I liked that our guys said, absolutely not, Coach. We, we're going we're gonna to do this thing. So I was very, very encouraged by the scrimmage. I like this team. I like the tenacity. I like their focus. And we've gotten better every day. You talked a lot about what you learned about your players. Mm -hmm. Uh, so conscientious, uh, very meticulously organized, just like all the you know the ones that I've had been very good. Um, uh, you know, and you always uh, every, every one of the things I like is you got to be adaptive. You got to be adaptive to your guys. The good news for us offensively is uh, we've got we've got plenty of uh, 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 explosive players and guys that are really good football players. Uh, so uh, we just gotta, you just gotta get the ball to your best guys and all that stuff. We gotta, we put in a whole bunch. You kind of throw everything at them, and then you start narrowing it down. And to be quite honest with you, you know, uh, um, I would probably, I don't, I can't remember every year, but most of the time, your first scrimmage, you, you better be successful defensively. And uh, and so I, nothing, not not anything at all. On my part, uh, we just, as far as concern, I mean. We've got really, really good players. I think the best players that we've had since I've been here offensively. Uh, we got to execute. We didn't execute very well. You know, we, we had some opportunities that we missed, and then we had too many negative plays. Does it take time to learn how to communicate to work with the new coaches? No, I mean, I think I think that I think one of the things we learn is that it's just kind of like I, you know, you know, you gotta you gotta kind of go and kind of figure it out yourself, but. We've been communicating a certain way here for five straight years. And so what you find is you'll find that, man, those are the things you're going to be good at. So we kind of reassess and come back and say, you know what, we just need to narrow and simplify and, uh, uh, you know, things that you don't have to, you know, have to, to mess with, you don't mess with. But the good news is, man, I'm tell you, I, I tell you a guy I'm really proud of. I thought DeMario um, – I could tell how much it meant to him and Kalen, these seniors. But I, I mean, I, I mean, I'm gonna tell you something now. We've got uh, Traylon Smith. Is I mean, he had an unbelievable day today. Uh, uh, Eno Benjamin has had an unbelievable camp. But Demario Richards has had his best camp. Kalen Balaj has had his best camp. So we got some good problems there in that in the, with, with that group. I thought J, uh, uh, JJ Wilson had his best scrimmage. Uh, and just I go through every one of them. And our big deal is, you know, making sure that we 
you know, we probably shouldn't have messed around with move. We're trying to get the right combination up front, and you got to get snap. So that was a little bit disruptive. Uh, even though it, there was a lot of penalties on offense, most of them were with the threes, which are new people. Uh, we had four penalties with the twos, uh, and we had three with the, the offense. Obviously, you know me, I one penalty is too much. But uh, to play uh, 50, I think we played 50-something plays with the ones, 50, 54, 56, something like that, and only have, you know, have three penalties, uh, you know, you're going to play – I don't know, 30 more plays. Hopefully we were going to run 30 more plays than that, 20 to 30 more plays than that. So we, we, we need to continue to, to narrow that down. But I feel really good. I got a lot of belief and confidence in our team because, man, this team, when you get when you get, when you you get got these guys captured and they got, man, they, they got each other's back and each other's heart and you have that type of uh, – uh, and it's been physical. We've been at a very, very physical camp. We've gotten after it. I like how our team is. I feel like we have a close football team, and then everything this this point forward is just continuing to to narrow and refine, get good at what you're doing. Uh, early in the season, it's a team that beats themselves. Don't beat yourself. Uh, you mentioned JJ Wilson. It seems like this offense has a lot more opportunities for Wilson, Hudson, even Franco Bass, Arturo, or Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, we're returning to more of, of what we did in 12 and 13 and 14. Uh, you know, we want, you know, obviously when we had Chris Coyle and how we utilized tight end, uh, and, as well as, you know, utilizing our backs out of the backfield. So, you know, there's there's just in this offense, there's more opportunities for tight ends and fullbacks and those type guys because, you know, you can't be physical if you don't have broad blocking surfaces and you create those with, you know, guys outside the front five. So the tight ends and the fullbacks. So, and, then, uh, you know, I, th I think it's an area where we're getting better. I think Tommy Hudson's had a really good camp. He's continuing to get better. I, I like his physicality that he's bringing. How have you rated quarterbacks progress from the spring game until now? Yeah, very well. Everybody talked a lot about the uh, offensive weapons you guys have. How do you think you best utilize those weapons throughout the season? Excuse me? The individual weapons that you guys have on offense. You spoke to those. How do you think you best utilize them? Well, I'm not obviously I'm not going to say that to the news people. I mean, uh, we're, we're going to we're going to get the ball to our best guys on their less guys. That's what I'll tell you. And just about evaluating the quarterbacks, uh, qu quarterbacks are just like head coaches. You know, just worry about winning. You know, win. Our biggest thing that we've come out of this camp on that I did like about Saturday in turn football over uh, with our ones. Yeah, you know, we don't we you know obviously I think we did one interception with the twos. But uh, we have been better this camp at taking care of the football, and that's that's the key to winning is 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 don't beat yourself by turning the football over and getting negative plays. That second part of it in the scrimmage, we had too many we had too many sacks, we had too many negative plays, and that that means we didn't we didn't make really good decisions. And there's lots of factors that go into that, but uh, uh, you know it's 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 obvious. You know that's one of the things that I do. I'm, you know, people don't realize, I mean, I've always been hands-on on that, is that, you know, I used to play, uh, uh, I remember playing, uh, just give you an example of this, I remember playing against, I was the defensive coordinator of West Virginia, and we were playing Pitt, and they had Larry Fitzgerald, and it's first and goal from the eight, and I'm going like, man, we're in trouble, I mean, this guy's really difficult to stop. And uh, I don't think they threw it to him one time, and we won. So you got to get the ball to your best guys. It doesn't mean that you, but you also got to run a system. You got to have a philosophy. And uh, we want to be a we want to be a physically a team that runs the ball physically, uh, and that uh, you know utilizes our personnel. So we'll take what the defense gives us first, but then we also you got to get the ball to your best guys. That's what we try to do. So something I've always had a, taken an active role in because you just don't want to go. And we didn't do we didn't we didn't we have we weren't we didn't do a lot of game planning for for that for that scrimmage either side of the ball, uh, but also I mean I, I just like the competitiveness how competitive they were and uh, lots of good signs, um, you know. Um, uh, but we had a lot of missed opportunities and too many negatives. That's that's the difference. And with with a with a you know a few few amount of plays, that's kind of what you're going to have. All right.